Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Selma and if you're new, you must welcome. As you are away from today's title, I'm going to be doing tips and advice on how to look good on a budget. If you're broke and you're trying to look put together and good, keep watching. So I did write down a list of stuff that I'm going to be talking about just because I'm not very good at talking. No, I'm not good at talking. Having these notes over here are gonna help me like remember stuff because my brain honestly doesn't work. I don't know. So of course, if you wanna look put together and you in a budget, you gotta start with the outside, okay? Like the physical appearance, the clothes you wear say a lot. You're gonna make sure you have like a good style, like find clothes that fit you, that fit your body. But most importantly that make you comfortable and make you feel confident because if you feel confident in what you're wearing trust me you're gonna look like you are super put together once you have figured out like what clothes fit you and all that and your style now you gotta like take inspiration from like social media especially pinterest because honestly i get some of my inspo ideas of what to wear on pinterest there was just a bunch of ideas there and it's free so if you can just go type in like how do i style these jeans for example you're gonna have a lot of ideas and also nowadays people share a lot of like reels on instagram where they show up their outfits and on tiktok as well so just get inspiration from social media because many people are out there sharing their talents and you can get inspired on how to dress you don't need to go buy new clothes all the time just because you think you have to anyways let's say you buy like a set like you don't need to wear the same set the same way all the time you can like style it differently you can like substitute the shirt or top with like something else or you can substitute the bottom with something else like you just gotta be creative with what you wear and that way you're saving a bunch of money and also being creative with your own clothes and of course if you want to buy clothes please go ahead but also another tip on how to like get like clothes you can go thrifting like thrifting is such a good way an affordable way to like get amazing clothes like you can find stuff from like gucci you can find stuff from prada in thrift stores and it's so so cheap you have a bunch of videos where i go thrifting if you guys are interested i haven't posted one for this summer hopefully soon i will honestly find good quality clothes that you can like switch up and wear with different stuff and it's so cheap so affordable and also it's good because like not only are you buying clothes for a cheap and reasonable amount of price guys i don't know how to explain but i hope you get me but also the money that you're using to spend to buy clothes is actually going to charity because most thrift stores support charities and that is such a good way to spend money i find it super easy to like buy clothes online as well if not thrifting because honestly going into stores i feel like the price is a little bit more expensive than if you were to like buy everything online because online you get a bunch of discounts so it's much easier for me to buy stuff online and there are so many um shops that you can buy stuff from pay in is one of them which is very good it's very affordable and then there is temu i haven't personally ordered from temu but i've ordered from shein before but like ordering online is so nice and you can get a bunch of different deals discounts if you're also lazy like me sometimes you don't have to go out to like buy clothes because honestly i feel like it's a headache like i would rather sit down look at my laptop or phone and scroll and look for something as long as you have your like size guideline and all that you will be good the clothes are done and you have figured out your style all right guys i'm editing this now and i forgot to mention that you also have to accessorize your outfits to make them look even better like adding jewelry and kind of finding out a way to like twist them look unique i don't know if that makes sense but yeah Next thing is like divided into two it's either skincare or makeup so let's start with skincare because honestly it's the most important so you gotta make sure you're taking care of your skin you gotta make sure you're taking care of your nails like 
I am Muslim, so I cannot like do big nails because I then can't pray. But just make sure your nails are like short and clean. I don't know, you can also grow them as long as they're clean. You see, they gotta be white. They cannot be any color. You cannot have any jam in them. Because if you wanna look good on a budget, you gotta make sure you need like everything on you has to look put together. You gotta make sure you're moisturizing your body first of all. Your body gotta look shiny because trust me, when you moisturize and when you don't moisturize, these are gonna see a big difference. So make sure you're moisturizing your body. Make sure you have a really good face routine. That's why I'm focusing on face because like the face needs a lot of protection because not only is it outside in the sun, but you also put a bunch of products on there when you wear makeup. But if you don't wear makeup, it's still gonna look nice, okay? So make sure you have a good face skincare routine and just moisturizing and using SPF like that's important because you don't want to get sunburned but also it helps you prevent diseases like cancer and skin damage all right so now that you're taking care of your skincare adding makeup makes everything look even better it's nice and fun to like try out different makeups tutorials like all of this is all on social media so if you don't know how to do your makeup just go on to TikTok. There are so many people that do makeup and on Instagram as well, on YouTube as well, but like on shorts, even long term videos on YouTube have makeup tutorials. So make sure you check out different um, makeup tutorials and see what makes you look good. Also that makeup product don't need to be expensive at all. I know there are very many brands that are super expensive, but honestly, you can find good quality makeup by using just drugstore. Cause most of the time I'm using like drugstore. Like I feel like almost all my products are drugstore makeup products actually. You don't need to waste lots of money onto like famous brands. When buying clothes, makeup products, I always think smart. You don't need that expensive thing in order to look good like there is so many options you can find for like cheap prices and you're still gonna look put together now that you figured out your fashion and clothes and makeup and skincare the next thing is taking care of your body literally what you put in your body is gonna make you boost your mood and feel good like you can look good but if the inside is not feeling okay then it affects the outside a little bit like you can still look good but you're not gonna feel good i don't know if that makes sense so make sure you're eating healthy foods like it's of course good to go out eat and treat yourselves but do not turn it into a behavior because you are destroying your inner body and it's not healthy so make sure you're eating a balanced healthy diet and also exercising you can like move your body make sure you're going out for walks or like your body's getting like movement okay that way everything inside is working and the blood is circulating really good like also you don't need to waste lots of money by going to the gym you can honestly find many workouts on youtube i personally use youtube but like sometimes if i want to go to the gym to feel even more motivated then i would like pay a membership but otherwise there's so many workouts out there that you can find online on youtube and you work out and you're gonna feel so good because if you feel good on the inside the outside is gonna feel even better also another tip is to learning how to do stuff yourself for example like if you do fake nails like you you can learn how to do everything nowadays on social media like just search in youtube how to make my nails at home you're gonna find it that you're gonna save a lot of money than going to the actual salon and doing your nails when you can do it at home and save like lots and lots of money so if you can like learn how to do stuff yourself that is gonna save you a lot of money and it's gonna keep you on budget but you're also gonna be looking good so this one is my favorite after you've done all of this now you gotta put yourself out there you don't have to but like just taking photos of yourself just gives you that boost you know and it inspires others like trust me many people compliment me when i go outside and i'm like okay i did not expect that but thank you well i do get compliments because i try to make myself look put together even though i'm not rich like this 
this is the whole point of this video to look presentable put together expensive without spending lots of money and basically that's it i hope you enjoyed this video and liked it and you got some tips and thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next video bye